Why do people take offense from me saying females instead of women? I often call females females, just as I call males males. Using women and men is problematic in the sense that it's very specific to a certain age group. You cannot call a little girl a woman, but at which age does she stop being a girl and become a woman? Or is it teenager? Or tween? Or gal? Or a million other variants? And at what age does she stop being a woman and instead become a lady or elderly lady or young woman or middle-aged woman? And so on. That's why I use female and male to not constantly have to think about know their age, what social status they have, what they as an individual prefer to be called, what the context calls for, etc. Female is not negative nor intended as such. I get really annoyed by people who instantly imply or downright state that I'm somehow degrading women by calling them females but the same is never said about males for some reason, but it sadly happens a lot. It's as if they are not reading female but rather bitch or something. As if their brains are search and replacing the word prior to interpreting my words. Female and male couldn't be more neutral, they are literally the words used to describe the genders. Nobody questions this use for any other animal, only for humans is it somehow, according to some people, bad or wrong to use the neutral, general terms female and male. Of course, some people look for any excuse to discredit what you say, and, failing to find an actual flaw in the message, start making things up just to be able to point at something and feel superior in their own minds. Not too long ago, I wrote a long text which had nothing to do with this, yet somebody focused on that one word, female, and ignored everything else I had typed, suggesting that I'm some kind of man-pig, which baffled me. Again, not once have I ever heard anyone say this about males, so they don't seem consistent whatsoever. Still, I can't help but feel as if I'm missing something. That's why I ask here. Using the word females to refer to women is seen as problematic for a few different reasons. Many of the people who use that word to refer to women will still use the word men to refer to men. Using females and men seems somewhat clinical and dehumanizing for the women by contrast. It seems like you don't do this, but the people hearing you speak will still associate you with those who chose to use the term in this unequal way. There is a similar issue where some people take offense when mixed groups are referred to as men and girls, when everyone involved is an adult. Another reason is that females is a more clinical term. It's frequently used in medicine and also in military contexts where the humanness of the subject is not the focus. It's used to indicate detachment from the subject. For this reason, many people don't like to be referred to with clinical terms. Many of us prefer to be referred to, in social contexts, using a non-clinical word like women. It's generally considered polite to refer to people using the terminology they prefer, not something you have decided according to your own criteria, should be inoffensive. The person you speak to gets to decide, not you. Finally, the term is tainted by association. A lot of misogynist, anti-feminist, straight-up hateful online communities use the term, female, or derivatives of it, femoid, etc., to denigrate women. When a term is used by a hateful community enough, that taints it for normal people. Most words we consider slurs today started out as simply descriptive terms that were then used to denigrate groups of people and that turned them into slurs. Human language is fluid and meanings change depending on how the word is commonly used. The term female is slowly undergoing a change of meaning. That means, if you use it some people will associate you with the kind of people who use that term to indicate that they consider women subhuman. The term males is not used in large online communities to indicate that men are subhuman, so people don't have the same visceral reaction to the word. 